Hey guys, Alyssa Ramos here from Alyssa Child Movie, and I'm here with Kim. She does double K diving here at Playa del Carmen. We just went shark diving last week, and now we're going to go diving in a snow day. But first, she's going to do a little beginner's intro of how to put your scuba gear together. So. Okay, so first, I'm going to take the jacket. The jacket you always want it to be in front of the tank where the regulator is going. You don't want the regulator that way and the jacket that way. So, this side. Okay, I'm gonna put like that so you can really see well. So first, you have one strap you want to pass. The big one. And then you want to take it down. If it's hard taking it down, you can always remove the first one and lose it like, put it a bit like more loose. And you always have one safety one. This one don't need to be tight. About the height, you want the top of the jacket to be on the top on the tank, like the top of your jacket arriving here. Okay? So you can put it down like that. If you need, you can help if you need to have the right height. And then you want to pass through the last one and find it. Then you want to make sure it's not moving. Okay. Sometimes you have a handle, like that, you can even like, oh, okay. yeah. <laughs> so strong. <laughs> then you're sure it's well attached. Once you have that, you're going to take your regulator. Okay. Regulator. You want always the inflator holes to be on the side of the inflator. You don't want it to cross, okay? Then the regulator will be on the right. And then the two other ones depend. It can be on the left, on the right. But always this one on the left, this one on the right. Then you want to remove the cap. Really important to put it back before you rinse your gear. So you unscrew it, you remove the cap. And then it's really easy. You just put it on your tank. And close it. You don't need to close it like so, so tight. Why? Because there is 200 bar pressure in the tank. So it's fully enough to like seal everything. So you just want usually to use, especially for guys, just three finger. It's sufficient. Maybe for me, I can put the hand. I'm not Superman. Okay. Then before opening the tank, you want to attach the inflator hose to the jacket. For that, you need to lift it up first, put it here, and then until the little click. Then you secure that is well attached, it's not going anywhere. Like that. <laughs> like that. <laughs> okay. up. So you need to lift it up. Yeah. Oh. Keep lifted up. So you need to keep lifted up until it's all the way and then you until it clips. Sometimes you can do all of it. Okay. 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 Then you want to secure it. You don't want that to pass behind you. So always you want to secure it here. Sometimes you don't have, and here you want to secure the cap. Mine, I have two security, this one, and then the other one. Okay, now we are ready to open the tank. Really important, we don't want to face that. That can be in glass, and it can break with the pressure. So you want always to put that away from you before opening the tank. To open the tank here, I'm going to show you. It's not towards the jacket, but toward you. So at the back. So that's far away and you open the tank. To open the tank you want to open it fully. You, don't see well. you want to open it fully until it's blocked. When it's blocked you just do a little turn. And then it's ready. You can just try that everything is working. A little breath on your regulator. Check you are full tank of air, so 200 bar or 3,000 psi. And you can also try your inflator, full inflate your jacket, and try the little perch. And you have also one at the back. It's not leaking, it's just when it's full. Oh. Yeah, when it's full, let's put it full. If it's full, it's gonna just stop pressure and get out the air of the jacket. No, it's not like no, it's from here. So yeah, you want to make sure you don't have any leak. 
your equipment is set up and then you want to make sure you have your pin and your mask ready and yeah, ready to go in the day. Awesome. Thanks so much and this will also be on my blog if you need to see it in written form. Bye.